Hello all and welcome back. Today we are going to create this beautiful 3D infographic animation using PowerPoint. So let's get started. Let's first enable the guides and then format the background with any solid dark color. Next go to insert tab and then draw a oval shape through center of slide holding down control and shift keys. Make it no outline and then change its fill color with solid white. Now duplicate this circle shape using control plus D and then format it with gradient pattern. Choose top spotlight accent 3 among the available presets and then make it a two step gradient. Change right side stop color with light pink color. And then adjust the stop position until this pink color appears at the bottom of the circle as shown. Next go to soft edges feature and increase its value maybe until 55. And then place it over circle shape. Make sure we have bit of pinkish color effect at the bottom of the circle as shown. Now duplicate this shape using Ctrl plus D and change its right side stop color with light blue color. Adjust the stop position and shape size until we get desired effect as shown and then place it over the original circle shape. Now again duplicate this shape using Ctrl plus D and change its fill color to light shade of grey color. Go to soft edges feature and then increase its size to 100 points. Now place this circle shape over the original circle in such a way that we must get light grey shadow effect on top as shown. Now again duplicate this shape using Ctrl plus D and then format it with gradient pattern. Choose bottom spotlight accent 3 among the available presets and then make it a two step gradient. Change both the stop colors to solid white and then increase the transparency of left side stop position to 100%. Adjust the stop position until we get desired shadow effect and then place it over the original circle shape as shown. Next group all these shapes together and then align it centrally to slide. Now duplicate this group using Ctrl plus D, reduce its size and then place it as per the design requirement. Let's continue to duplicate this shape three more times and then place them in all four directions. Now again duplicate any one of these groups four more times, reduce their size and then place them to fill the gaps as shown. Bring center circle group to front and then send all small circle groups to back. Finally, add PNG icon and text fields on our design. Let's speed up to save time. Next go to insert tab and then draw a line shape as shown. Change its outline color to white and weight to 3 points. 
Also change its beginning and end arrow type to circular pattern and then set them to maximum sizes. Now drag this line holding down control key to create the duplicates and then place them on all four corner circle groups. Add heading text fields to complete the design. So here is the preview of our design. Let's now continue with the animation portion. Before we start animating these shapes, let's first group each circle with its PNG icon and text fields so that we can animate them together. Now let's enable the animation pane and then apply flying animation to all circle groups. The sequence of flying animation depends upon our selection sequence of all circle shapes. So let's select all these shapes from top to bottom sequence. Apply flying animation. And then increase the duration to 2.5 seconds. Now starting from second animation group, increase the delay duration of all below groups by 0.1 second. Select all the animation groups, go to effect options and then increase end bones effect to 1.9 seconds. So that's how the animation effect will look like. Next select all line shapes and apply wipe animation. Select bottom line shapes and then change their animation direction from top. Now select all the line animation, start them with previous and then increase the delay duration to 1.75 seconds. It must be somewhere in middle of circle animations. Next select all heading text fields and apply zoom animation. Start them with previous and then increase the delay duration by 0.25 seconds. So here is the final preview of our animation. Hope you all liked it. Please don't forget to like, share and comment. Thanks for watching and stay tuned.